We have a problem. Elund Karth refuses to send any troops to assist Melsen Shear. The old fool never would listen to reason. A weapon is only as strong as the one that wields it, and a general is only as powerful as the army she leads. We need to convince Karth to lend us his aid. You can find him in the upper city, looking over the strait at Melsen Shear. The fool might as well be condemning the city. They're in the city, but they can't join us unless Elund Karth grants his blessing for them to go with us. Agarth has gone to reason with him. He was a fine fighter, as I recall, but I do not know if his diplomacy is as practiced. Mind your step. Do not miss Leogriff's many marvels. Someone else will have to. Damn fool. What do you want? I'm beset by petitioners these days. Another advocate for this absurd plan to retake Melson Shear, I take it. Look to Rathia's sister across the strait. Her battered walls, her burned gardens, her back broken from a decade of war. We take in refugees. We send them food that we can spare, we try to ease her pain. But for ten years I stood here and watched her die slowly. And now you, a stranger, think to convince me to commit the whole of this city to saving her because our army's greatest failure has recovered some old relic. Mel Senshir stands as Rathia's eastern shield. Even now, nearly broken, she still stands. This city can do nothing for the fortress, but perhaps its people can. The wounded we have here wish to return to fight for the fortress one last time. I'll tell them to meet you at the docks, and take this as well from my own collection. May it be of use to you in the coming battle. Go to the eastern docks in the lower city and find Captain Dodwin. He will oversee your journey to Melson Shear. Go. Save our sister across the sea or die with her. Citizen. City watch, move along. The watch sees all in Rafia. A prayer for my troops. Curios, talismans, items of power.
Great. The ships are loading now for Melsen Shear. Are you ready to board? Right away. Agarth, you know better than any of us how this will end. Why must we fight a war that you know we will not win? You would still ask that to Lara. After all you've seen. Until I get an answer, Fate Weaver. Until then. Why do we fight? Because there is hope. Because only through battle can we break the chains that Fate has forged. Don't you see? We have been given a chance. And though some of us will die, we will die knowing that our lives were finally our own. That we are no longer slaves to the whims of fate. Would you throw it away? Just for fear of another defeat? Not I. I will fight. And if I die, I die knowing that I have made a choice. And this choice, for good or for ill, was my own.